set the date we never thought it would ever be here. Here we are. We made it. The day I met you, I truly believe was meant to happen. You won my heart that night even though I made you fight for a date with me. I was living day by day just doing what I felt I had to do. I just had to go to work and just had to go to school. It's what I'm supposed to do. But now I have so many reasons to better my future because it isn't just my future anymore. It's our future. You give me reasons to better not only myself but the future that is in store for both of us. I could never imagine building a life with anyone but you. Not only have you managed to make me feel, fall so madly and deeply in love with you, you have made me love myself, which is something I never thought could happen. You give me a confidence I have never felt, and you have helped me realize truly what is important in life, this crazy life that I couldn't imagine going through without you. You have made me a better person today. You have brought me to the happiest that I have ever felt before. You have become my best friend, and I can tell you anything, and what's even better, I can just be my complete weird self with you. You make me laugh harder than anyone ever has. Eric Robert Liebner, today I become your wife, and we be in our forever. A forever filled with love, happiness, and laughter. I promise to always give you unconditional love and always be faithful to you. I can't wait for the day I get to come home and tell you we are expecting our first child, or to, tell you, to have you be there when I graduate college. I thank God every day to have been so blessed to meet you. Not only to meet you, but to be spending my life with you and build our amazing future together. Therefore, as God's chosen people, so today is a day of joy because you are, first of all, chosen of God. Not only are you choosing each other to be husband and wife today, but you have been chosen by God to be his children. What an amazing thing. God's love for you is boundless. He commands you in response to his love to love each other. Love is forgiving and enduring. Love shows itself in truth and faithfulness, in thoughtfulness and understanding, in patience and kindness. You are now invited to declare this intent in the presence of God and these witnesses. Eric, will you take Julie to be your wife? Will you be guided by the counsel and direction God has given in his word and love your wife as Christ loved the church? Will you be faithful to her, cherish her, support her and help her in sickness and in health as long as you both shall live, if so answer, I will. Julie, will you take Eric to be your husband? Will you be guided by the counsel and direction God has given in his word and submit to your husband as the church submits to Christ? Will you be faithful to him, cherish him, support him, and help him in sickness and in health, as long as you both shall live, if so answer, I will. I, Eric. Hey, Eric. In the presence of God and these witnesses. In the presence of God and these witnesses. Take you, Julie, to be my wife. Take you, Julie, to be my wife. I promise to be faithful to you. I promise to be faithful to you. As long as we both shall live. As long as we both shall live. I, Julie. I, Julie. In the presence of God and these witnesses. In the presence of God and these witnesses. Take you, Eric, to be my husband. Take you, Eric, to be my husband. I promise to be faithful to you. I promise to be faithful to you. As long as we both shall live. As long as we both shall live. Exchange rings as a symbol of the lifelong commitment and abiding love which you as husband and wife have promised each other. Therefore, I declare that they are husband and wife in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Those whom God has joined together, let no one separate. Ladies and gentlemen, I present to you Mr. and Mrs. Eric Liebner.
my beautiful bride and best friend. As I look back on the last year and a half, I've realized what a blessing you have become in my life. My whole adult life, I have prayed God to put a woman in my life that has the same morals, beliefs, and interests as me. God gave me you. My prayer has been answered. And today I make that promise to him and to you that I will love you until the end. For a long time I wondered if I was ever going to find the right woman for me. When I least expected it, you came in my life and instantly made me the happiest man in the world. Anytime I'm around you, you bring me instant joy. You're always there when I need you, and I know there, that is something I can always count on for the rest of my life. I'm thankful to God that my search is over. The feeling of being content with you is something that can't be described. As we make our promises today to God and to each other, it will be a day I never forget. I promise to love you, take care of you, be faithful to you, and be by your side. As we start a new chapter in our lives together, I look forward to every day that we get to grow up closer with each other. I will always be your shoulder to cry on, and will always be right by your side through the good and the bad. Eric Robert Wiener, I love you. And don't forget about our appointment today at 1.30. See you at the Altar Buttercup. Love you more. Jules. I look forward to starting a family with you, and I look forward to all the memories we'll make together. Till death do we part, Julian. Love your soulmate and best friend.